familiar with the abandoned building's history know it simply as the Murder Hotel. The infamous hotel was run by a mysterious family for several generations until close to in unrelated news, the trivia murder party killer is still on the loose. Up next, my paycheck. <laughs> This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. Your free spa weekend was a lie, luring you into this deadly trivia game. Only one of you will survive. The rest of you will die. Was that clear? I'm trying to be a better communicator. Okay, first question. Who is the little red-headed girl that Charlie Brown adores? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, it's time. Housekeeping! We're at room 105. Are you ready to fall? It loveth my new minigame. You're going to drop down this board and try to avoid the death zones. Hmm, someone needs to pick which slots are death zones. Go ahead, everyone else. Choose a slot to make it no bueno. Hurry along. Okay! Let the games begin! Pick a spot to drop from! It's so hard to predict what will happen! Ayo! You know what this means! Ghost now. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Let's keep moving. I don't get it. What does the Babadook have that I don't? of you, follow me. Welcome to room 237. Let's play with dice. Roll as much as you want to add to your score. I'll kill the player with the lowest score. But go over 21 and you die instead. And don't forget, if they roll a skull, that adds one to everyone's score. Honestly, it's mostly just an excuse to use these cool skull dice. It's your last chance to sneak a few extra rolls in. I see you're unlucky in dice. Ghosts would just fall through the bottom of an elevator when it goes up, but I guess ghost rules don't make any sense. Let's try another one. What design is on each Oreo?
Who picked this? Oh crap. Let's keep moving. Look, I know I'm dealing like with my own issues, but the ancient Greek gods were a bunch of weirdos if you ask me. What was Hermes thing? Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. I'm giving you all scratch tickets. What a quirky last minute gift. Scratch and find three dollar signs to live. And if you keep scratching, I'll give you cash for all the extra dollar signs you find. But if you scratch off even one skull, you die. Scratch away. It might be fun to press your luck. The contest is almost over. I guess I was hoping you'd be a little bit more scratch happy. Oh well. We know what a losing ticket means. We're here! When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question! In the comic strip Peanuts, which character's last name is not Van Pelt? my money pile. Go ahead and take as much money as you want. But, take the most money or the least money, and you'll be sorry. Have fun out there! Excited to see what everybody took. Uh oh, the most greedy and least greedy must be punished. <laughs> Let's try another one. Ugh, torture really works up my appetite. It's cookie time! I've earned it. Hmm... What am I tasting in this snickerdoodle? Who picked... this? I'll have to kill my writers. Let's keep moving. Which sword could I not bring to fencing practice? <laughs> Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. Let's do a spooky handwriting test. Oh, hey, look! The ghost of my Aunt Mildred is writing on this mirror. She has her own consistent handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will all the safe players. Draw a word on the mirror to camouflage Aunt Mildred's. Go ahead and start writing. 
Watch closely. One of these new words will be a word written by Aunt Mildred's ghost. So many convincing words to choose from. Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote or you die. Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Aww, you got it! <sighs> Stupid mirror game. <sighs> Unbelievable. Let's try another one. Which word can I substitute for the word substitute? Who picked this? Well, that's no fun. Let's keep moving. If someone weighs 200 pounds, about how much of that weight is skeleton? Who picked this? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I want to show you something. Now we learn obedience. Follow as many rules as you can before time runs out. Everyone else is playing too. If any of them correctly follow more rules than you, I will kill you. The rules are already on your device. Go, go! Speaking of rules, you ever used a slide rule? It's kind of like a guillotine, but for numbers. Rule time is coming to an end. There's always someone out there better at following rules. Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive. But will you be the one to escape? I'm going to give you a category. Fortnite skins. Let's see the right answers. You move forward one space for each correct answer. You're a little bit closer to escaping, but you're not alone in here. If a ghost catches up with you, they will steal your life force. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. almost up. A lot of lucky guesses. Lines from Liam Neeson's speech and taken. Scott's older than Ronald McDonald. Kind of a gimme. Uh-oh, here comes trouble. Here comes the darkness. Galaxies. Time is 
almost up. The darkness approaches. Metric system units of measurement. I'm going too easy on you. Endocrine lands. The exit is so close. Fuck the brands. Time is almost up. You're better than I thought. It's not over yet. You need a perfect answer for your final escape. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. You have to get all the right answers to escape. Next question. Winners of RuPaul's Drag Race. Stop! Yeah. 